So as I stated earlier, the Parks Department has more power than the mayor, right? When Mayor Bloomberg was in office, I believe, he put into law that he was going to plant a million trees in New York City. And in fact, he wasn't planting any. He was making homeowners and developers install trees at the curbs as they built and enlarged their homes. Now, if you can't fit them because of a hydrant or a curb cut or a utility pole, you still have to plant those trees someplace else and Parks Department will tell you the species and where. And you have to give a two-year guarantee. Now, let's just say you have that same 50 by 100 lot. You want to build a home on it. You need to put a curb cut in to get to that home, a driveway. Sure. The tree's in the way. Well, that's a city-owned tree. You can't just take the tree down. The bigger the tree, the more money they're going to charge you to take down the tree because their stance is they own it and they've been maintaining it since that tree was born. Mm -hmm. And I've seen people pay in the six figures to take down trees just to be able to put a house on the property. Wow. So the tree fund is a big topic in New York City. Hundreds of thousands of dollars, if not millions of millions. dollars. No, yeah, millions. yeah. I, I got, I, I'm uninvolved in a job now where somebody has to pay $40,000 just to take the tree down.